the pioneer in this way, in this time in the world, in the COVID time, the pandemic time, the time of the social unrest. This is why I am an artist. This is why, this is my purpose for being an artist. The barbershop scene was really moving and it meant so much to me to have that representation. What did it mean to you to be involved in Pixar's first Black-led animation? I, I am honored. I am honored to not only represent the film and, and Pixar, everything they've done in the past is something, I, you know, it really aligns with my beliefs and my core values, but the representation of Black people and Black culture, jazz, music, it, soul music, it, it, it really moves me to be a part of anything pioneering, but to pioneer in this way, in this time in the world, in the COVID time, the pandemic time, the time of the social unrest. This is why I am an artist. This is why, this is my purpose for being an artist. I think that's so true. I mean, hopefully it's the first of many, but yeah. this was, we really hit the ground running with this one. It's incredible. Spend your precious hours doing what will bring out the real you. Love, the brilliant, passionate you. Love, love, that's ready to contribute something meaningful and to this world. Love, love, Get ready. Love, your life is about to start. You're a Grammy-nominated musician, an activist, and a mentor. How do you use music to make a difference and ignite the spark in others? I think music is a very powerful language because it's universal. You can laugh and dance and sing with the person next to you and y'all don't have to have anything in common. So I've been doing things, whether it's playing in streets, subways, uh, uh, traveling across the world, touring in concert halls, protesting in the street, protesting based on the belief that we are all in this together, it's connected. That unification comes in such like small forms, even like the the rhythm of like chants and the way that all of us can connect with it. it it's everywhere. And I really love the way you put that. Oh, thank you. That's right. The chant is it. That's our first music. <laughs> From the moment I wake up in the morning to the moment I fall asleep at night, I was born to play. It's my reason for living. Your jazz compositions in the film really did something to my soul. Can you tell us how you got involved with the film and how much you knew about Joe's story when you began composing? Wow. So I got involved with the film to, at first it was just to be his hands and to um, be a cultural consultant for the film. And it evolved over time. This is about two years ago. And I, I really was very, very, very happy about the way my role sort of became a part of the film in, in so many ways. I didn't know anything about Joe other than the fact that he was a pianist and he was a middle school band director. <laughs> and <laughs> I, I saw many cuts of the film and gave feedback on many different aspects of the film. Bringing to bear my life story and a lot of my experiences as a musician um, because they wanted it to really feel authentic the real deal. So if you're a musician who has toured and played in the jazz world, as I have, as Herbie Hancock, another cultural consultant, has his whole life, Terry Lynn Carrington, amazing force that she is, we all gave our feedback and said, this is really what, um, this is really what it's like. And if you wanted to feel that way, you we'll have to adjust some things here and there. Yeah. Um, and, and ultimately it came across in a way that I've never seen music come across in animation ever. Yeah. It's amazing. It was so different, but it, I loved it and it really aided the film. I think this film wouldn't be the way it is without music. Yeah, so much music. I mean, two vinyl <laughs> albums of music from the film and inspired by the film. It, I, I think that music is is really the heartbeat of the film. This is incredible message. That's the that's the narrative and that's the spine of the film. But the heartbeat is that music, and there's so many scenes where the music is pulling the narrative forward. Thank you so much for taking the time to speak to me today. 
Oh, yes, indeed. Thank you so much. It's a pleasure to talk to you. Thank you.